Hey guys, uh, I thought yeah, I should show a little bit about the Technicritus and who we are and uh, what company we're working with because I think that a video around our office tells you a little bit more than just a PowerPoint or the shiny things we're doing. Uh, this is Johan working with Business Development. Hi. Hi there. All right, uh, this company, Technicritus, we are working, the biggest asset we have is our staff. So we thought one way of getting brilliant people to stay and brilliant people to sign up and, and love what we do. They used to have a lot of meetups and so on. So we built a, actually built a little stage here. And the reason we have a stage is that we're hosting TEDx, Chinapreneurs, uh, sketch meetups, lots of different meetups to both boost the team we have, but also to find, to get new people in the studio with a beer in their hand and then, then discussing interesting things and then they love it. We have a little nice rooftop terrace. We sometimes, quite often, lift a car with a crane up here when we're working with it and we're showcasing it. Doing a little bit of barbecue. And we have the main studio where people sit and work. It's very quiet today. I love that. It's in the morning and then in the afternoon it gets more hectic. Philip working with some design, something, concentrated. We sit together, designers, developers, and uh, management. We got a little horse, we love our horse. We have a nice, hi there. Yay, we have a nice office up there. Look at this, I just need to show you. We bought a levitating lamp. Ooh, isn't that nice? It's floating, you can even touch it. Do, 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 do. And it is levitating. I love it. All right, Stefan working in the uh, Chenjin, the Chinese part of it, he's here and he's working with sorting capacitors. Oh, according to sorting stuff. capacitors. For building uh, things mm, late in the day. Sounds good. Beer fridge, very important. Uh, yes, the best coffee beans in town, Pasalacqua, we love them. And I think coffee is a big thing. The company. And I showed you before a little bit about the podcast studio we have. Is nothing too fancy, but it really does the trick. We can shoot some movies and we can, yeah, show what we were doing and shoot some interviews. Uh, we also double this room as our strategy room. And right now it's the launch room for the product launch we do. As I said before, one of the biggest things we do is actually the, the biggest asset we have is the team we have. So we're taking care of the team as much as we can. So we're building, or we build it a gym. People like to work out a little bit. And then we thought of, it's a bit more social thing. So we built a climbing gym. You can go climbing here. Gothenburg is actually a world-class climbing because we have very, very good rock here. Due to the ice for many, many years ago, all the rock is smooth and it's world-class climbing. So everybody have their own climbing shoes. And you can go climbing or training. And if you have kids and so, it's a little bit easier to stay fit if you actually can do it at work. And this is a watch we're building. Wow, look at that. Mmm, I love it. All right, we have a couple of floors. Uh, let's take a sneak peek. Oh, there have some meeting. That was our boardroom. We have a little bike workshop. Uh, we have dressing rooms. We think that, that taking care of people, as I said, that's the, the most important, single most important thing we can do. Because the people is the ones building the design or doing the tech or creating the innovation. So we need to take care. We have a number of strategy rooms or design rooms. We can lock them. So we have a little bit of security. Well, it's not shut, but of course you can lock them. Um, which means that if you have something that should not be viewed by everybody, we can close it here. We have four of these rooms. They also double as a silent room right now because we don't need to lock everything in. And people want to be locked in and be silent. And then we're sitting here. Also, this is developers and designers in a mix. We like to mix things. We are very close to technology. And this is... Uh, virtual reality rig and we have a haptic chair so you can look at that one and you can control the chair in all different directions and you can simulate quite a lot with it 
and yeah, it looks like it's actually running. I need to start it, see what's happening. I know what's happening. No, it didn't work. It's something happens. And this is one of the other projects we did, which became a company, which become acquired by Navico. This is the huge screen and the system we built for, for uh, controlling a yacht. And, and basically you can do everything on the big screen here and you control it with, I'm sorry, it's not only, it's not, there's no power to it. And you control it with this jog wheel because it's a little bit easier. Touch is not good in, on a bouncy boat. So you control it with this jog wheel or you use the steering wheel buttons. And then we have most of the settings and most of the other functionality on a tablet. And the reason with that one is that we can run Android on this one, so it's much easier to develop and it's much easier to integrate third party apps. And then we can have our own system on the big screen. So we think this is a neat solution to actually have both very dynamic, very modern UI or mo modern software to actually integrate other softwares with it. At the same time, we can keep full control of the software actually controlling the bot. And then underneath you have all the, we have some tooling and we have some soldering and other equipment. We're building lots of these rigs. And because of that, we have some, that's a laser cutter. We have, have a, this is a 3D printer printing in liquid. This is also a 3D printer and this is another laser cutter. We use them quite a lot. Um, we're not building hardware in that sense, but we are integrating. So quite often we are, the stuff we're building is actually part of what a workshop is maybe building a concept car. And then we need to integrate into that one. So I hope you liked it and uh, you got a little bit more sense of who we are and what we do. Thank you very much.